Christina. Welcome back to my channel. Today I wanted to share a Too Faced mystery unbagging with you guys, but sadly the moment after I bought this, I looked it up and everybody gets the same thing in the mystery bag. So I wish I would have looked that up before I purchased it, but I mean it was such a good deal that it was, it was worth it, but I wish I had looked it up and watched a video beforehand because I wouldn't have purchased this. Um, yeah, it's a good deal, but I already have the the main product in here. Um, but I'm excited to try some of this other stuff. So I wanted to share this with you guys. And then I got two samples as well. So that's pretty cool. It's, it was a good deal. They had a sale. So if you guys have never seen the Too Faced Mystery Unbagging for 2018, then you'll be able to see what comes in the mis the mis mystery bag. I just figured when I read mystery bag that everybody would get something different. I was like, oh, maybe they'll just throw a random palette in there and, you know, some goodies. Because it said it always equals like $109 or more or something. So I thought, okay, well, maybe they'll just throw something in there. But no, everybody gets the same thing. The first thing in here is the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara. I use this right now. I have a sample size one that I use and I like it. I did not like it the first time I tried this and it was a sample size that I had tried and I had a sample size of the waterproof one and I loved that one and then I had another got another sample of this one and I tried it so maybe one of the formula was just off on the first time I tried it but um, I do like this so this is really cute I don't remember the value of this but I will put it right down here so you guys can see what the value of that is the next thing in here is the Too Faced La Creme color drenched, color drenched lipstick and it is in the color Double Bubble. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this yet or not or use it. I haven't decided. But these are really, really good lipsticks. I will put the price for lipsticks, the, the La Creme lipsticks, right down here. It's a very bright pink. But sometimes I do like to wear bright, bright, bright pinks. So we'll see. I have not decided on that one yet. The next thing in here is, I'll show you guys the samples that I got, the two samples I got. Um, one of the samples is the Hangover RX infused with coconut water, the face primer. I haven't tried this, so I'm excited to actually try this. This might be a really good face primer for me. We'll see. Um, if you've tried this face primer, definitely comment down below and let me know what you think of it. I've tried the Shadow Insurance, I think. I think that's the only thing I've tried, so... This is the Sun Bunny Natural Bronzer. It, at least it's different than the Chocolate Soleil, which usually comes with everything. So, you know, everybody has the Chocolate Soleil. This packaging is super cute. It's a plastic compact, and it's really flat. And then it looks like this. Um, I usually don't use bronzer, so I'm probably going to throw this in a giveaway or send it to a friend. I haven't decided what I'm doing with this yet, but I wanted to show it to you guys. So that's a really cool little sample. Okay, next in this set that comes in this set is the Perfect Eyes. The Too Faced Perfect Eyes Waterproof Eyeliner. And I don't have a whole lot of eyeliners that I'm actually like really, really loving. So I'm probably going to try this one. This is a creamy, long-wearing eyeliner that lasts for over eight hours. And it looks like this. And it has a little smudger at the end. So that's cool. I don't have a whole lot of, I mean, I used to have one like this, but I can't remember. It's been a really long time. I haven't seen one with a smudger in a while. So this is what it looks like. And then we'll do a little line here. Yeah, it is really creamy. So this will probably be a good eyeliner for me. And let's see how long it says, 24 months. So that's really good. Okay, so I'll probably keep this and use this. Yay. So there's one thing. I will put the value of that right there and then the other thing that I was like well okay I guess I'll try it I'm not like I wouldn't buy this on my own but I'm super you know excited to try it because I like to try new mascaras but this is called the Too Faced Size Queen a mascara that measures up multi-dimensional mascara I'm not going to open it because as you know when you open mascaras you only have they have a short shelf life so you only use it the moment you open it so I will definitely do a video and use it doing a look soon so if you guys want to see a look even sooner than I'm planning, then definitely comment down below. Let me know. Say, hey, do that look and use that mascara soon so we can see it. But this says actual size. So this is going to be like a really, really thick mascara wand, which is cool. Hopefully it'll work really good. Not get it all over my eyes and my face. 
So, yeah. I'm excited to try this, but I wouldn't normally buy this or try it had I not received it in a mystery bag, if that makes sense. Um, so I'll put the value of this right here. So the very last thing that came in the set, I also think this bag is super cute, by the way. I, I don't know what I'll use it for, but it's cute. Um, the last thing that came in this set that I already own that I was not very thrilled about when I <laughs> looked up the what comes in the mystery bag um, is the Too Faced Peanut Butter and Jelly Palette. I have this. I have had it for a while. Um, but I have a friend that doesn't have any Too Faced products. So she was pretty excited when I was like, hey, would you like this palette? She was like, um, yes. <laughs> So, um, this says, don't worry, sweetie, this product doesn't contain actual peanuts right there. So, this is a really good palette. If you don't have it, I really like the little, the little Too Faced palettes. They're amazing. Um, I only have one chocolate bar palette, and I haven't used it enough to say that it's amazing or not. But, um, I do want to try more of the big chocolate bar palettes. But uh, the little mini palettes, I really have loved all of the ones that I've ever tried. Um, so yeah. Definitely check those out if you're interested. So that's everything that came in the mystery bag. Like I said, it is a good deal. I just wish I had known that it wasn't like a mystery. It's not a mystery because if you look it up, everybody gets the same thing. So it is what it is. Um, if you guys have any of these things, definitely let me know down below and let me know what you think of those things. Like my video if you guys like me sharing different things with you guys. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And check out the giveaways playlist for open giveaways. They'll be in the parentheses. They'll stay open. And then comment down below. Say hi. I love to hear from everybody. Or comment down below and let me know some of the stuff that you've tried. If it's any good. Or if you don't like it. If you've tried the peanut butter jelly palette and you didn't like it. Then just comment that down below too. And let me know why. Um, And then of course I will do a video soon with these two. Letting you guys know what I think of these two as well. And then I haven't decided if I'm keeping this or not. So we'll see. If I do, then I'll try to do a look with all of them together. And then I'll just do like a full face, two face um, look. Because I do have a sample of a two face foundation. So I could do that too. So if you guys would be interested in seeing a full face, two face look, definitely let me know. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.